I have always, um, you know, put my health as a priority. You know, always um, did, did my, had my annual checkups with dermatologists, OBGYNs, you know, whatever needed. So I was just having my regular um, physical checkup and my doctor, Elizabeth Palmer, who definitely has been a hero in my life. Um, I was sharing with her some family history. My sister at 40 had tragically passed away and her autopsy did show that she had some somewhat of heart damage, um, a little bit of a heart condition, and I vaguely shared that with Dr. Palmer, and she suggested that I have a calcium score. So I had the calcium test, and she said, you know, your heart score came back great, which I was thinking it would. Then she had let me know that they discovered something um, of slight concern in the lung area. Discovering this abnormality, I guess you would call it, with my um, calcium score test, you know, I didn't know that HMG um, provided above and beyond just the calcium score. I, I had no knowledge. Now I know, you know, that most offices, that's, that's what, that's the only thing they look at. You know, if they're going, you're going in for the calcium score of the heart, that's what you're looking at. But here at HMG, they actually, you know, took the time, the radiologist, to look into surrounding areas. Had that not been the case, you know, um, my outlook would have been <laughs> much worse. So I had then, you know, leaning forward, went and had a, a biopsy, and it was announced really fast. They didn't make me wait any time. And they came into the room and said, it's cancer. So we had to figure out a plan of treatment and I did have um, my right middle lobe removed and a portion of the top lobe removed. And it was a nine millimeter um, lung cancer tumor. It just fascinates me that something the size of a pea was discovered in my body, you know, to, to be removed so that, so that I could live. <laughs> and, but I just have to keep reminding myself that although it was, it was tough, or it was tough, because I'm definitely moving forward now. Um, it was a, a blessing more than anything you can imagine, this, um, this gift of life. I feel like I've been given, given back my life, the opportunity to raise my children and, and be a wife. If I were to say a thank you to the folks at HMG, it, I would be speechless because how can you thank somebody for giving you back your life? I mean, they're, I haven't met the radiologist who made the discovery, but I would want to have my kids and my husband with me and let them say thank you as well, because that, you know, one man who took the time to sit down and read that and, and just to make note of that, you know, does he know that he, that he, was, that he saved my life? And I've never met him, <laughs> so. Um, I would just say thank you for giving me the chance to be a, a, a mom because I, I wouldn't want them to grow up without me. So, you know, words would, would be hard to choose <laughs> on what to say. Maybe just, 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 I would say, you know, look at my family and what you've done for these children. My name is Carrie, and the cardiac calcium score at HMG saved my life.